about which one is this one which one is this notification now I'm like really which one is this one? <laughs> oh okay that's fine that's okay that's okay hey everybody how are you guys doing it's the beginning of a new vlog i don't know what's going to happen in this vlog in truth i'm going to tell the truth i don't know what's going to happen in this vlog i am home today today is friday the 14th of january i'm home today because i don't have to go i didn't have to go into the office today didn't have to go into the office today um it was my first week back at work and sweetie normally the first week back at work for me is great because okay let me take off my glasses because the reflection light normally my first week back at work is great you know i've got the energy it's a new year blah 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 i spent most of this week sleeping because i think it's finally actually hitting me that i'm tired okay i worked and i created content right throughout december i finished my work year work work year i finished that at the beginning of december so it's just and now we're back at it and i didn't stop i didn't take a break where i was just like you know what i'm not gonna mm. and i know a lot of content creators right now are, are taking breaks because maybe they chose to work right through december with vlogmas and whatever and now they're taking a break I ain't taking a break. So, um, I had a little bit of a mental breakdown about this a couple of days ago because I was just like, yeah, no, this can't be life. You know what I'm saying? This can't be life. So, I'm going to plan a trip with my sister um, sometime in Feb because we're in Jan now and it's already the 14th of Jan, halfway through Jan. Um, so, I'm going to plan a trip with my sister for Feb. <laughs> excuse me so i'm here today i'm working here and i was doing some content reels for instagram i did three reels today for instagram and tiktok tiktok obviously with tiktoks is not reels but you know what i'm saying tiktoks i pretty much paste the same thing on instagram and on tiktok um so i did that I don't immediately release them obviously no they're gonna go up over the next couple of days or a week or so and then um, answered emails sure small things those ones and then I uploaded a vlog which is gonna go up today at 4 now in the next 15 minutes did I even announce it now having a smoothie because that's my life right now okay i'm trying to be healthier so here's the thing i told myself that i'm gonna go off carbs completely i'm gonna i'm gonna film a health update video and all of that but i told myself i'm gonna go off carbs and alcohol and then i had a mental breakdown last week and i needed a drink to help me sleep so I broke my no, no alcohol rule. I did, I did. But I came up with something. I came up with something for the no alcohol rule. I told myself that, you know what, it's fine. Drink the alcohol as long as you're drinking spirits as opposed to wine, the calories in wine, sweetie. Don't do that to yourself, okay? Uh, so drink spirits as opposed to wine and ciders and whatever. I typically don't even drink ciders anyway, so it's fine. I, I visit ciders. Ciders tend to be nice, you know, on a day where you're nursing a hangover. The day after, the night before, yeah, born, and you're nursing a hangover and you're like, yo, if I can get me a cold breezer now or a cold brutal now, you know, that kind of thing. So it's fine. Uh, but typically for me, every day basis, I'm a wine or a spirits girl. So gin, gin. So I'm having gin now, I, not now, literally, but I have decided that I'm going to have gin with sugar-free tonic going forward. And I made this decision last week when I was having my mental breakdown. And it seems to be fine because I've had a couple of glasses of gin over this week and um, last weekend as well. And I've still managed to lose a kilo and a half of weight in one week. So... 
I already know. With me, I already know. It's not really the food, it's alcohol. The wine that I had over December and no, in November, it wasn't, it was not doing me justice. Anyway, how are you guys doing? It's a new year. How's your year going so far? Are you subscribed to the channel while well, we're here? Are you subscribed? Do that. Do that. Shop at the subscribe button. Or shop at the notification bell. Or be happy in life. Really. I see be happy. Really. Really. Um, so I've got a couple of things to show you. And I'm going to show you those couple of things while I have a chat with you. While I actually finally, ch finally change my purse my tiny purse that i currently use because i use small bags right now and all of my beautiful purses are big so i'm trying to do that since COVID times i've switched to smaller bags it works for me it's less uh work when you're going into the grocery store or whatever i literally just swing it cross body and i don't worry about it whereas big bags which is typically what i have a lot of um yeah it's just too much work you know, maybe when COVID goes away and whatever. Big bags I only pull out when I'm going out, you know. But before we get into that, I changed my phone. <laughs> okay, okay, wait, there's no messages on there. Okay. Yeah, so I changed my phone. Um it's just it's it's beautiful. It's beautiful. I typically don't make a huge fuss over phones because when you get when you are grown and you you start getting expensive phones this is what starts happening okay you realize that okay once i have the phone the first thing i need to do is get a uh, insurance on that phone and the more the the latest the brand of the phone or the latest the number or whatever of the phone the more your insurance will be so for me it's not even like i got the phone and i was just like ah it's fine. I'm still gonna have to pay an arm and a leg for it monthly, and I'm still gonna have to do this, this, this. I, I ain't even gonna lie. My contract was due for an upgrade, and I didn't see the point in waiting. And I was just like, okay, fine. I'm gonna get the phone. So I got the phone. Um, <laughs> then I had to get insurance for it immediately. Uh, that's why I didn't really film an unboxing or whatever because it was opened and. Um, I immediately put in a screen protector like a privacy screen protector and a cover screen protector and cover cost me a thousand rand that is what happens when you go and you get these fancy phones this is an iPhone 13 uh, uh, what do you call them Pro Max I've got it right here okay, I get you off yes this is an iPhone 13 Pro Max and it's great the phone, I still haven't played around with the phone. I still need to watch a couple of videos, you know, so that I can maximize the potential of my iPhone, right? So I'll do that. The phone in itself, great. Picture quality, great. Cinematic shots, great. This is why I did reels today, because I wanted to see what the phone is going to do. I did reels with my phone and not my camera this time around. So I was quite impressed. Um, and then... So yeah, I didn't film an unboxing or whatever because I was just like, ah, what's that lie, yo? I was more stressed about getting it insured than happy about the fact that I'd gotten a new phone. But now I'm kind of excited about it and it's nice, it's great. I'm on the MTN network. I'm sure you can see with the yellow, which is South African or African or African. Um, you know, they come with nothing, basically. Just comes with a little wire. This just comes with this, which is sitting here, and that's it. Doesn't have an adapter, nothing. <laughs> Apple doesn't rate us because you kind of buy everything now with Apple. It's kind of crazy. Even with laptops, you have to buy the cable to connect your SD card to your guys. The connector. You have to buy the connector. To connect your SD cards or your your anything USB what what stress later. This is the privacy screen guard, which is really really good. This one is good because somebody can be sitting right here next to you on the couch, and you can be sitting like one hundred and ten percent. Even if that person went, they ain't gonna see shit. 
I get to see. I'm just saying. Can can only tipa. Can only tipa, okay? And yeah, so all together the cover and the screen protector was a thousand bucks, which drove me up the wall. I won't even the phone is great, love it. I'm gonna change and start using this now. It's Friday today, I don't really have any plans. I'm probably just gonna sit in the house, relax, have a drink, maybe. I don't know, I still haven't decided whether I want to have one. Um, catch up on some Netflix, because I haven't really had a chance to watch Netflix. Um, I've been watching The Wife on Showmax, Khomu. I am tired of that man beating up on this woman, though. And here's the thing, that in the books, that's exactly what happens. It's exactly what happens, but uh, it's just hard to watch. It's really hard to watch. It's hard to watch. So, but it's really good. I think it's 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 well shot. It's such a good. It's such. It's it's good. Okay, I'm gonna change this art. With all the cars that I have, guys, I need to make sacrifices, eh? Oh. My daughter, why am I not supposed to watch the video now, Nalit? Ah, uh, because we're sisters and that's the fucking way, guys. Yeah, we don't watch each other's videos, but when, when they... When the title looks interesting, and I cried. When the title, oh, problem is I'm not going to That's why, my lady. That's why. Okay, no. Anyway, I'm just checking up on you. Um, I'm gonna go home. I'm, I'm almost home. I'm gonna go take a nap. Maybe later, if you're not doing anything, I might call you. I might just go get some lunch or something. Depends. I'll see. Can I or not be? I'm literally sitting in my house. I'm doing my makeup because I'm gonna record. But I'm literally okay, sitting in the house. Okay. Now, now people are gonna hear all your nonsense. <laughs> oh my god! Okay, bye. Everybody, remember to subscribe to Jessica Kelly's channel. Okay, bye. Thanks. Say that again. Everybody, remember to subscribe to Jessica Kelly's channel and stop watching without subscribing. Cash me outside. How about that? Cash me outside, sister. Thank you. Bye. bye. <laughs> Oh my god, what a mess. Who does she even belong to? It's not to me. <laughs> Hi everybody. Hey, hey. Um, I got a little t-shirt on my head. I was talking to my sister. I'm sure you guys have picked up a little bit of the conversation. Obviously, in editing, I have to edit out quite a bit of what she was saying. But, never mind that. Um, hey guys, it's the next day. Um, the reason why I have a t-shirt on my head is because I washed my hair today. Washed it, conditioned it, hey, all this, ooh ha, what, what, and I do not like using towels on my hair unless, I don't know, unless it's like a last minute, like I'm at a, a, at a hotel or whatever, blah, blah, but normally at home I've got like one or two t-shirts that I have that I will, um, Put on to dry my hair because I feel like t-shirts are a little bit less abrasive than towels are so I'm about to record I'm gonna record the first content sit down content for the year in this room today so I've got my studio I'm actually looking at my studio lights now and I'm gonna be sitting in front of my desk I'm gonna figure out how I'm gonna do it but excited about it just uh, you know, dipping in here to let you guys know that it's a new day. Nothing interesting is happening today. Nothing. Absolutely nothing interesting is happening today. Uh, which you've probably seen. I was talking about the phone. Um, and I see now that I'm getting a lot of DMs uh, on Instagram. Because I shared the phone on Instagram as well. And I see now that uh, I'm getting a lot of DMs on Instagram about how did you get the phone? I've been on a waiting list for so long, three months. I've been waiting for this phone for three months, blah, blah. I don't know. I just went to MTN and I got the phone. The specific one that I wanted, mine is the uh, 256 megabytes, giga, mega, 
gigabytes uh giga is the 256 gigabytes and uh i can't 128 for me storage wise is far too small considering you know that i am a content creator so th there's just a lot of stuff on my phone a lot not only that but there's also work stuff on my phone documents and stuff especially since we've been working from home everything kind of comes through to my emails on my phone and then i just save them in the files you know section and stuff so 256 is always a nice medium for me 512 is far too big and obviously the cost would be much higher which is not something i plan on doing okay paying a ridiculous amount for a phone and whatever i would never like if i if if i get to a place where i can buy a phone cash sure but would i i don't know i don't think so yeah it's saturday tomorrow i'm gonna vlog this weekend because well not much today because i'm recording all day but uh i'm gonna vlog this weekend because tomorrow i'm going out with the family and we're going for lunch uh, at level seven which is where i've been to level seven before i actually filmed part of that kind of vlog when i was out with the boy and we went to level seven and i put it in a vlog but yeah so we're gonna go to level seven tomorrow i really haven't done my makeup in such a long time i'm literally fucking this up big time um i finished reading seven days in june yesterday this morning at 1 a.m loved it put up a review on goodreads absolutely loved it gave it a five star you know it just talks about you know black love you know it's a romance but a beautiful take on you know mature black love without it being smutty and you know sex all over the place and whatever there are some sex scenes of course in the in the book it is a romance novel so there are some sex scenes but they are so tastefully done even i was reading really going like Whoa! okay shane <laughs> okay shane i see you but it was like really nicely done which i absolutely loved i need um yep. yesterday i was watching sims right video about oh, i've closed my laptop the camera is, pop, is sitting on my laptop the tripod is sitting on my laptop she was doing a video about uh youtube and she was you know just just giving advice on you know what to look out for uh, for new content creators and you know how you know we might have similar numbers but it doesn't mean we'll make the same amount of money monthly and 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 and, and she's right and i thought it was such a um a wonderfully informative video but at the same time i found it very encouraging i felt like you need videos like that where people aren't just telling you that it's hard you know if it's something you want to do do it you know do it do it if if it is something you want to do but um it, it just just encourage as well you know and i think she just hit the nail on the head with that video she really did she did such a good job with it um so do i even want to put uh eyeshadow on today do I filming break because I'm tired <laughs> I filmed three videos I have got two other ideas of other videos to film having studio lights is amazing because you do not need to worry about natural lighting at all you can film at night much the setup right now so it's a little bit untidy there's my m50 there and the lights go on and it literally illuminates let me show you what it does so bright this is what i was filming look at this look at that the lighting is amazing okay so i pretty much sit here as you can see in front of the lights the lighting is phenomenal 
okay uh, but yeah I'm on a break I have a salad from Kauai that I got yesterday I can show you maybe I might just dip into that let's go or we are in my kitchen this is the salad I got this, uh, it's a steak, steak Asian salad or something yesterday and I never got a chance to eat it, okay. Uh, it's got a, like a little cream sauce thing that goes comes with it. I typically don't dive into the sauces. That's how it looks. It's like a steak salad with a little bit of avo. It's been sitting in my fridge overnight. I took it out earlier on to so that it's not as cold i don't like eating salads that are really cold 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 it's not a thing um so i'm just gonna dip into that while i wait for the girl mm, it might need a little bit of that sauce that crunchy lettuce chair mm, mm, mm. Mm -hmm. it is um saturday today so i typically give myself saturdays off from making green smoothies but I still try to eat something clean. It's as clean as it gets. So there's some red cabbage in here. Um, red pepper, robot peppers. A lot of lettuce, which is good. Avocado, which is amazing. Mmm. 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 If she gets here and she's hungry, <laughs> she better not make her problem my problem. That's all I'm saying. She gets here and she's hungry. Mm, there's no food for her. Nothing. I don't have to order something. Nothing. Mmm. 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 Freaking good, bro. Wow, it's good. Okay. Let me eat some. All right, wait for the girl. I'll touch base with the guys a little bit later. Good morning. It is half past 11 as we speak. <clears throat> I need to be out of this house in... Maybe about 40 minutes. So I was just doing my face. Uh, I think I did say yesterday that I will be going out with my family for lunch today. Uh, we're going to a restaurant called Level 7. We like to go there. Whether we're going there with like partners or friends or whatever. I've been there with my partner, friends, family. All of them. Um, but it's a really, really nice place at uh, one of the Radisson hotels next to the airport. So we're going there together. We're going to go have lunch. So I need to be at uh, the family home in 40 minutes. Um, aside from that, yesterday... My sister ended up coming. I don't know if I filmed anything yesterday in the evening. I think I did after I recorded. So I ended up recording yesterday and then I filmed the little clip, I think. And then I went to bed because I ate something. And then I went to bed because I was a bit of a mess, okay? Um, but I recorded. On the good side, I ended up recording. That's pretty yeah. much my look today. Red lips. I swear, if I haven't, if I go, if I go a long time without wearing red lipstick, I really struggle to reapply it. It's so weird. Like I cannot reapply it without a liner. And even when I do reapply it, I'm just like, I don't know how I feel about this application. I'm actually looking at what I'm gonna be wearing. Right there. Should we zoom in? So that's what I'm going to be wearing, not my jacket over there, but I'm going to be wearing a white shirt, black jeans, the Gucci sneakers and my bag and all of that. So I put that out there this morning. Oh wow, it looks so good. Mm. Alright, <clears throat> so... I use quite 
a number of things in terms of oh, what helps wow, it's so good. Um, wow, that looks great. Books that will help me. Okay, okay. Let's check this one. Listen more. Oh, Listen wow, more. that looks but phenomenal. What they had to All right. I'm so excited at how good this footage looks. I love the lighting. I really love it. I think the studio lights are doing the absolute most, honey. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I can't wait to edit this, but uh, that won't be today. <laughs> Maybe tomorrow I need to, when I come back from lunch with my family, I need to uh, prep and I need to get things done and dusted. So yeah, I need to prep for the week ahead. So I won't have time to edit today, but I love it.